how to work with CJ Dropshipping, one of the best suppliers that we can work with today on our dropshipping business. CJ Dropshipping has maybe not been around for a while, at least not as long as AliExpress and Alibaba, but they are a direct competitor to them and are actually much better in so many ways. In this video, I'm going to talk about CJ Dropshipping, how to work with them, a full overview on the supplier and everything that you can do with them and how to profit in your dropshipping business. So just watch this quick intro and let's begin. What's up everybody, hope you're all having a wonderful day today. My name is Liran from AutoDS, I'm the content manager and I've also been dropshipping for the last several years. And in this video, I'm gonna talk about CJ Dropshipping, one of the best suppliers that we can add to our dropshipping businesses today and really grow with them and profit. So everything that I'm gonna talk about is already written in the blog, which I'll leave a link to right below this video. But in my videos, I always like to add in some extra value. So let's get on with the show. One second before that, if you are new to our channel, this is the part where you need to subscribe to always stay updated on all of the latest and all of the hottest topics that we have coming out in the dropshipping world. That being said, let's go right on ahead to it. Who is CJ Dropshipping? Why are they here and what can we do with them? CJ Dropshipping started as a small Chinese supplier, but in the last few years, they definitely expanded themselves. Today, I think they have over eight warehouses around the world and the US warehouses are the best selling ones. They quickly found out that dropshippers are for them. Unlike AliExpress, where AliExpress started as a seller to end consumer platform, and in time, dropshippers quickly got on this trend and started dropshipping off of AliExpress. And then AliExpress made some transitions to make themselves much more dropshipping user friendly because they found out that dropshippers make up for most of their sales. CJ Dropshipping, on the other hand, they started as a from dropshipper for dropshipper platform. So right off the bat, their service is only for dropshippers. They do not sell to end customers, unlike AliExpress. So everything that they've built around their system, everything that CJ Dropshipping has done from day one has been strictly and directly for dropshippers. So that's just a little history. Now let's get on with the show. And in the next few minutes in this video, I'm going to explain to you guys exactly why they are one of the best dropshipping suppliers that we have available today and how they are different from any other supplier that I've tried working with. Okay, so what are some of the benefits of working with CJ CJ Dropshipping. The first one, they have a huge variety of products. Let me just show you their website. So here is CJ Dropshipping's website. As you can see, it kind of resembles AliExpress's website where you got the categories on the left side, a rotating banner here in the middle, and the categories even look the same. They have the same words and maybe even the same icons. I'm not sure. But when you hover over them, you get all the subcategories on the right. So once again, it really resembles AliExpress's layout, at least their basic layout. And they got flash sales, flash deals, just like AliExpress. The reason that I'm showing you guys that they very much resemble AliExpress is just so you can see the comparison and that they are really trying to compete with them. They're seeing exactly what their main competitor is doing and they're implementing the same practices on their website, which is very similar to the advice that I'm always giving you guys when it comes to looking at what your competitors are doing, whether it's their Shopify store, or the products that they're selling on eBay or Shopify or Facebook or any other selling platform. You copy your best competitors practices and do the same things on your store. Do not copy the same products one by one, but do find similar ones and so forth. So always get inspired by your main competitors, which is what they did over here. But at the end of the day, they offer a much better package than AliExpress, especially when it comes to dropshippers because they only sell to dropshippers. We're going to get to all of that really, really soon. So here's CJ Dropshipping's main website. And as you can see, they have a lot of categories, lots of subcategories and lots of products, which we didn't get to yet. Another great advantage of working with CJ Dropshipping is that they have US warehouses. So a lot of their inventory is already inside a US warehouse and they can ship it out from the US to the US anywhere between two to five days. Some products you have to pay for shipping, others you won't have to. And there's a link right here which can take you straight to the USA warehouse. Or you can simply search for any product on CJ Dropshipping and simply filter it by the US warehouse as you can see over here. And as you can see, they also have a warehouse in Thailand, China, Germany, Indonesia, Australia, Japan, Canada, and we can go on and on and on and on. So as time passes, I can see that more and more warehouses are being added to this list. CJ Dropshipping wants to be one of the biggest suppliers or local suppliers that's available all around the world. So a worldwide supplier that's available everywhere. So in our case, we're talking about the US. So we're going to search for products for any product that they have in the US warehouse. 
So right now there's a search with no words at all. So I'm just getting all kinds of random products from a US warehouse, or I can search for something specific, but let's just go inside any product and see what we have in store. It'll take me to the product page where I can get more information about the product, but I wanna show you that it's actually coming out of a US warehouse. So here we have this electric van car dual head cooling. So it's two fans for your car that are USB operated shipping from a US warehouse. So this product costs $19.78. And as you can see, we got free shipping over here. So we're shipping from the US to the US. This product will arrive anywhere between three to seven days. Standard US shipping, estimated delivery time three to seven days, shipping costs $0, tracking information available. So that's how you know that the products are coming out of US warehouses. And that is one of the biggest advantages when working with CJ Dropshipping. There are so many warehouses to choose from. Therefore, you can ship quickly to any country that you want. Just search for the product, see if it matches your warehouse, see if it matches your location, put up that product up for sale. And when people buy it, they will see that it will arrive fast to their country. And that is going to give you a nice competitive edge over your competition. Another reason to work with CJ Dropshipping is because they have reliable customer support. So for any problem that you may be having, you can simply on the top right, go to their support center, click on ticket. And here you can open a ticket wait for them to get back to you, which is usually quick, or you can even open a live chat as you see here on the bottom left and get a representative to chat with you live on any problem that you may be having. So customer service is one of the most important parts when it comes to running a successful dropshipping business for the long term. And this is one of the things that we really wanna pay attention to, make sure that the suppliers that we are working with have good customer service that we can pass on to our buyers. So reliable customer support, check on that. Another great advantage of working with CJ Dropshipping is that you can source products and negotiate to get better prices. So this is something that a lot of people are doing. Not too many people have too much field experience when it comes to sourcing products, but you should know that CJ Dropshipping does have an option to source your products. You can even buy inventory. You can buy stock from a Chinese warehouse, store it in a US warehouse. So if, for example, you have a product that is selling well, but it's coming from China and the shipping times are slow, you can ask CJ Dropshipping to source this product product for you, you can get a quote. They will quote you for, let's say you want to get 100 pieces of some teddy bear from China. So there's a place where you can post a sourcing request. Once again, all the links that I'm clicking on, everything that I'm showing you guys, I remind you is on the blog in the link below this video. So what I can do in this sourcing request, I can click on individual product. And here I can tell CJ Dropshipping, hey, look, I got this product. Either it's selling really well for me. So can you get me a price if I want to get 300 of this unit and store it in your warehouses so they can source this product, find it from Chinese suppliers and get a nice quote for you to ship some inventory to CJ Dropshipping's warehouse. You can also check with suppliers by yourself, see how much it's going to cost and then talk to CJ Dropshipping about how much it's going to cost to store those products in their warehouse. So you can do it both ways. And another thing that you can do here is you can simply tell them, hey, look, there's this product that's selling really well. Maybe you guys should bring it to your stock or allow me to drop ship it. So you can either make a bulk purchase, ask for a quote for a bulk purchase, or click on drop shipping and give them the URL of a product that's selling really well. And simply what you're doing here is you're recommending them to get this product to a US warehouse or to any other region's warehouse because you know that this product is going to sell well for them. So you can do two things here. They both work really well. And this is a great benefit when it comes to working with CJ drop shipping. I can't think of too many suppliers that that give all of these benefits all in one package from one supplier. There's only one at this point and it is CJ Dropshipping. Another great benefit of working with them is that you can combine several packages in one package or several products in one package. So in other words, today, for example, when you're buying products, for example, from Amazon or Home Depot or Walmart or even AliExpress, Lowe's, Home Depot or any supplier that you can think of, once you add several products, they are not coming from the same warehouse. So if one customer buys five products from your store and you buy those products and ship it out to that customer, they're going to get their packages at different times and different days, which is not practical or convenient at all. But when buying from CJ Dropshipping, five different items, but from the same warehouse, they will all be packaged up under the same package. So the customer is only going to get one package on one day and that is going to make it that much more convenient. So several products under one package is another great advantage that we have when working with CJ Dropshipping. Another great benefit is that you can add white label branding. This means that if you're already running your own brand, 
and you want each package to come out with a specific box or a specific brand in specific brand packaging then you can do that simply reach out to CJ dropshipping tell them all the orders coming out of my account I want it to be done like this with that they will tell you what they need on their side to make that work and that is how you can get white label branding on your packages easily with CJ dropshipping again I can't think of one supplier that can put all of these packages all of these benefits under one supplier supplier except for CJ dropshipping which is what makes it so great to work with. Now when it comes to return policies it may not be as simple as other methods like Amazon Prime where you have 30 days no questions asked whatsoever. CJ dropshipping does make it a little bit more difficult when it comes to returns so thank god that returns don't make up for most of our work. It's just a small percentage, but it's very important to take this into account. So they have no problem with returns, no problem with refunds and replacements, but just like any other Chinese supplier, they'd rather not get the product shipped back. They would want you to work it out with your buyer. Maybe they can send you some kind of compensation, depends on really what the problem is, and you can move that on to your buyer. At the end of the day, they'd rather not get the packages back. If something arrived damaged or didn't arrive on time, you can always reach out to CJ Dropshipping. They'll send another package out and that will fix that problem but it really depends on what the problem is and what you can do and how they can help you solve it. So if you want to learn about CJ Dropshipping's return policies, we have a link to it in the blog, which I said again is right below this video. But if you want to go over their refund policies, they have a full page for that. Very, very descriptive. And again, you can always reach out to their customer support for any problem that you're having, and they will do their best to help you out just as you're doing your best to help out your buyers. Everybody's looking for customer satisfaction. We all understand that the long-term survivability of our dropshipping business relies very much on and customer service. So go over the refund policies a little bit and always know that you can reach out to them on any problem that you have. Now, one of the biggest advantages of working with the supplier is the next benefit that I'm gonna to talk to you guys about. They have POD, which means print on demand. So you can actually drop ship print on demand products and this is really, really great. Let me show you what I mean. So I'm gonna click on the print full print on demand solution link on the blog or just go to CJ Dropshipping and on the top bar, you'll have the print on demand link. So it's going to take you to this page, print on demand, you sell, we print, print and ship on demand worldwide. So what you can do here is pretty self-explanatory. You can sell products to your customers and ask them how they want to customize it, what text they want to add to the t-shirt or to whatever it is that they are buying. So if you have a pet niche or if you have a general store, definitely, definitely check out print on demand and see if your customer base fits this model. A lot of people love to customize their orders and not many dropshippers know how to do it. Usually people who put up with print on demand, people who sell it, are those that actually do the print printing and the customizing. So it's usually not dropshippers, which means there's not a lot of sellers who are doing it, especially not dropshippers, but now you definitely can. So let's find a product to customize and add a print on demand. So here are some hoodies, let's go for that. Okay, so here is the hoodie product page and I wanna customize it, add my customer's text over here. So what I'm gonna do first is choose a variation that I would like to customize. So let's say I sold this variation. I paused my game to be here and we'll go with a size large. Shipping from a China warehouse, that's the only choice that I have in this example. Inventory, we can leave it as it is. Shipping method to the United States and here you can choose the shipping carrier. So as you can see, USPS will arrive in just seven to 13 days and that will cost $9.36 or $9.87, anywhere in between. You can also go with CJ Packet Ordinary, which in this case, it might make the package take a few days longer, but you can still save here like half a dollar. In this case, I would definitely go for USPS and pay a little bit more and get a really satisfied customer for faster shipping. So I chose my variation. Now what I wanna do is scroll down and click on Start Design. This is where we're going to customize what we want to be written on our print-on-demand shirt. So as you see here, there's already a text saying, I pause my game to be here. So what we can do here is work with layers, as you can see here. And if you wanna choose a different variation, you can also do so here. So since we already have a picture and text here, then not giving us an option to add text usually that option should be here but we do have an option to upload an image so we can replace this image with another one but that wouldn't make much sense in this case you can simply click on this link which will show you the back version of this hoodie and here on the back we can really upload any image that we want for example i can click on upload image it'll open up your file browser window here i'll just click on any picture like some australian dollars and here we go australian dollar photo so in this case what i'm doing is i'm adding this picture 
picture and it will be placed right inside this orange square that we see here. So in other cases, you can also add text to variations on CJ Dropshipping that is in their print on demand section. You can add photos, you can add text, and you can really customize your buyer shopping experience and make your store different than anyone else's. Print on demand is one of the best aspects when it comes to dropshipping, once again, because not a lot of people are doing it and you can really be one of the first to utilize it without buying all of the shirts in advance and buying inventory before you sell them. So print on demand, one of the best features that we have on CJ dropshipping. Another reason to use them is that they can offer you a service to make professional videos for a product that you are selling well. So if there is any product Product that you are selling well and there is no video for that product you can reach out to cj dropshipping tell them hey i'm selling this product really well can you make a video for this product and they will guide you through that process here there's a page where you can see how they are implementing what i just explained so video for winning products here they can give you that same service that i just talked about making great images which usually you won't want to go for images usually your product should have images but you can ask them to make white backgrounds transparent backgrounds as you can see here and so forth but really the banger here is the videos if you're drop shipping for example on shopify videos is one of the best ways to showcase your products so if you're missing a video for your product cj drop shipping has you covered now the next thing that i want to talk about is product finding aside from providing professional customer service and working really hard on the customer service part the other part that you need to work on really really hard is your product research and which products you are selling on your store that's the difference between products that will sell and products that won't sell and the customer service that you do need to work hard on is for the long-term survivability of your dropshipping business product research how can we find the right products to sell from cj dropshipping or any other supplier for that matter well there's a few things that you can do but one of the best things is something that i mentioned a few minutes ago in this video getting inspired from your competitors seeing what they are selling what's going well for them and looking for similar products to the ones that they are selling you can try to sell the same product, but you will have to obviously change the product description, change the title, change the marketing angle a little bit and so forth. But the best thing that I would do and what I do on my stores is I simply look for similar products, maybe a different variation of that product, a different color or a different size, a product that has the same features, but has some more additional features. Look for similar products to the ones that are selling from other eBay sellers or from other Shopify sellers or whatever selling platform you are selling on the second method is to simply use your supplier and search for products there so let's do that on cj dropshipping here i am on their website here on the left side we have the categories so let's just go ahead and hop into any category anything here would fit the dropshipping business model so it's not like other suppliers that you have to watch out for and see exactly which categories you're under and seeing if these products are you know if you can even resell them so you won't be having that problem here so let's go to home garden and furniture Let's go to curtains. Okay, so now I'm getting a whole bunch of curtains and pictures and other home decor products. Now, what I would want to do here is search for products that are actually selling well for this supplier. So what I would do is first you can sort it by the best match. This gives you the products that are usually selling the most. And the next thing that you want to do is see the lists. So here you can, you're actually checking the popularity of this product. And this icon is showing you free shipping. Now, I want to remind you guys, if you're working with AutoDS, you can include the shipping price always in the product's price. So whether the supplier gives you free shipping or not, AutoDS knows to take that shipping price, add it to your product price and still offer free shipping to your customers. So you do not have to worry about the shipping price, but do take it into consideration for products that do have shipping prices. So what you want to do here is to check the actual popularity of the product. So one way to do that is the higher the lists, the more popular it is. And if we click on a product like this one, for example, let's go inside the product listing. So here is the product page. Now what I want to do is take a look at the product, scroll down and see that there's a lot of information. We got the sizes, we got the product description and we got even more photos. So again, this really much resembles AliExpress's layout, but that's not the point here. So first, what we can see is everything here is complete and we really don't need anything else to sell this product. But what we do want to do is to see if this product is even popular. We want to check it in the market. So if you're drop shipping on eBay, what you want to do here is copy the product's title, but not all of it. Let's just take what this product is and maybe one feature that it has so this is an indian mandala tape tapestry wall hanging throw bedspread yoga mat it's not a yoga mat decor blackout curtains so it looks like a hanging wall photo but it's actually a window curtain so in this case what i'm gonna do is search for blackout curtains that have indian in it 
Let's see if we can find something close or something that's selling. So this is a very random product that I just chose, but let's just go with it and understand the structure, which is the most important thing here. So I'm going to search for blackout curtains, Indian, and let's even add blue. Okay, so what I'm seeing here is not the same product that I was seeing on CJ Dropshipping. Let's put them side by side to remind you guys what we are trying to sell and what we're actually seeing here. So nothing here looks the same, not even close. The next thing I want to do is see if this product is even popular, like if people are buying this product enough. So here on the left side, we have sold items, but not completed items. So I'm going to go back and uncheck completed items. Now I can see items that are being sold that have the words blackout curtains indian and blue in them and as you can see nothing looks like the product that we saw on cj dropshipping but all of these products did sell so today is may 4th and as you can see this product sold on may 2nd this one sold on april 24th this one on may 2nd this one on february this one on april 2nd so all of these products did sell in the last month let's scroll up a little bit here we got may 2nd april 27th april 25th so all in the last week or two so people are buying products that have blackout curtains and some Indian design in them in the color blue. So maybe this product will sell. Maybe we can give it a try. That is just one example of how you want to do it. But since the products there really were curtains and this looks more like a wall photo, I would move on to the next product. But that is a really quick example of how you'd want to take a product, search for it on eBay or any other platform that you want to sell on and see if this product is even popular, if it's even selling. So that is one way to conduct your product research. Now remember, CJ Dropshipping's got warehouses all around the world. So anytime you see a popular product, you can definitely find it on CJ Dropshipping in a warehouse that's probably closer to your target audience or try it on different warehouses to different regions in different locations and see if the product that is selling well in China or in the US can also sell well in UK or any other country that you can think of. So that is another great thing that we can do with the multiple warehouses that we got and one of the best ways to conduct product research. I would like to end this video with a very nice tip to save you guys a lot of time when it comes to adding products to your dropshipping stores and this method will simply help you get a whole bunch of products doesn't matter how much it can be tens to hundreds or even thousands of products at once and simply add them to your dropshipping stores really easily whether you're dropshipping on ebay or shopify it really doesn't matter the process is exactly the same so let's say you've been dropshipping with cj dropshipping for a while and you finally found a niche that's selling well for you and what you want to do now is add as many products from that niche as you can to your stores but not do it one by one save as much time as possible so that you can simply invest your time doing other things that will help you grow your dropshipping business and don't get stuck doing simple tasks like this one. So the first thing that you want to do is head over to Google and write down AutoDS Helper. The first page will take you to the AutoDS extension. So AutoDS Helper, I'm going to click on the first link. Here I've got the extension. Click on the blue link on the right to install it. So what I'm going to do in this case is once you download and install that Chrome extension, the AutoDS Helper, you'll see the circle here on the bottom. What I'm going to do is I'm going to click on it. Then I'm going to click on Extract. But before I do that, I'm going to scroll down all the way on the page. So if more products need to load up, they will. And I will have them on this list too. So once I scroll down all the way, I'm going to click on Extract. And what just happened is all of the product IDs that we see here on the left side, all of those 60 products that we have on this page just got extracted into this little small extension. The next step is to click on export as CSV. And as you can see, a CSV file was just downloaded on my computer, as you can see here on the bottom tab. There's no need to open this file at all. The next step is to head to the AutoDS platform. Then I'm going to click on add products, upload CSV, this tab up here. And here you can drag and drop that CSV file or click on it to open up your file browser window. Navigate to the folder where you downloaded that CSV file, double click on it, processing CSV, and file is uploaded. My supplier down here, I'm going to choose CJ Dropshipping. As you can see, AutoDS supports over 25 suppliers today and we're always working on making that number bigger and bigger. The region that we chose in this case was the United States. As you can see, AutoDS also supports Thailand. And of course, we are going to add the rest of them if you had to ask. Now you wanna choose your advanced options, click on next and start configuring your import settings, starting with the general settings, the pricing settings, shipping and policies, and then you can import them to your store add them as a draft or schedule to add them at a later date and time. That is how simple it is to add all of those 60 products or however much products you had in that CSV file and add them to your stores in just a few clicks. 
instead of spending days and weeks and months doing this process over and over again. So I hope that this will help you save a lot of time when adding products to your stores. One more thing worth mentioning is CJ Dropshipping's payment methods. In most cases, if we're dropshipping on eBay and Shopify, we're usually getting paid through PayPal. So with CJ Dropshipping, every product that we buy, everything that we purchase, we can pay using the same payment method using PayPal. So this way, everything stays under the same house and the cash flow is much more efficient for our online business. As you can see here, they also accept wire transfer, credit cards, Payoneer, which is something that a lot of people use, and other payment methods. So once again, it makes it really comfortable and convenient working with CJ Dropshipping. So we talked about all of the important things when it comes to CJ Dropshipping, especially the things that really help them stand out with their sourcing, fulfillment services, print on demand, and their photography and video service, and also their custom packaging. I really hope that you guys found this video informational. If you have any questions about CJ Dropshipping, if there's anything you wanna know, let me know in the comments below and I will personally answer your suggestions and your comments. And once again, guys, if you're new to our channel, this is the part where you need to subscribe to always stay updated on all of the latest and all of the hottest topics that we have coming out in the dropshipping world that has always been created from dropshippers for dropshippers such as yourselves. Thank you for watching. Good luck with CJ Dropshipping. See you in the future videos.